Brown square, oval bitches, rich, poor, slave bitches, smart, dumb, crazy bitches, prude, horny, dirty bitches, fat, tall, skinny bitches. What's up guys? Today I'm going to do a Slay Day sort of thing, but just for myself. I mean, we will be doing Slay Days with you guys soon. So, um, zero everything right here, okay? My friend let me my Virtus and all that. I bought my Arcane. Um, besides, it's only 60 mil now. It was 70, so that's good. Um, time is 8.31 a.m. I do have to go out a little bit later on today, but um, should still be able to get some good Slayer experience. This looks really pro right here, man. Look at this. This is basically max mage bonus, except for the swift gloves, or the whatever gloves, and... What else could you upgrade? Nothing. You could up no, you can't upgrade anything else. Nothing's better than Virtus, and Arcane, and Arcane, and this and that, and... Max bonus, oh yeah. Yeah. <laughs> I think this is the guy that was, like, following me yesterday at, like, uh, some kind of a Slayer task. You see? You see? Uh, see, I pay attention to my subs when they follow me and stalk me and look at me and yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, this is a lamp for agility. I, I got those last night when I was spinning right before I logged out, so when I was spinning, it kind of came out wrong. Well, not really wrong, but just weird. Now, basically, after today is over, I'm pretty sure I'm just going to go back to using effigies on uh, agility because I'm... I mean, using them on Slayer is okay, but at the same time, that does, that does make me behind on my summoning experience with the charm, so I'm going to continue just using them on agility, and hopefully I can get, I don't know, maybe like 40 mil agility or something by the time I get 200 mil Slayer. It'd be kind of cool. I think I'm... 25 mil right now, so 15 mil, nah, I probably won't get that much, but close enough. Now, if you do enjoy this type of video where, you know, I like, kind of, I'm basically kind of, I guess, like a vlog kind of thing, but it's like a RuneScape vlog, I don't know. Do give the video a thumbs up if you do enjoy that, I'll make sure I do more, you know, that's basically what a thumbs up tells me, if people like it, I'll do more. So, um, if you do enjoy this kind of stuff, um, I'll basically be showing you, I bet some of you guys already skipped to the end and be like, oh, let's see how much Slayer he's gained at the end of this. Watch me just end it right now and just be like, ha, that's how much I gained. Receiving my first fucking blue charm. These things are supposed to be good blues. They're like nine. Ki I killed thirty of them. Okay, what a troll! Now I get another blue charm. Okay. Actually, from what I remember, this task is actually profit almost. I remember when I used to kill these like a long time ago. I used to actually price check and stuff. Um, so yeah, room bar and like crush. I think crush net. Well, they used to be ten k, but now they're like seven k. I don't really know exactly, but four hundred s is quite a bit too. That's like forty k. All right, guys. It's been exactly twenty minutes now, and I've gained fifty. 15.9k uh, Slayer. Let's prove it. Let's prove it. 851. There we go. We started at 831. So, 20 minutes and we got 16k Slayer. That's basically 46k an hour, is it? I, th I think. Just just around. That's pretty fucking awesome. I guess this is going to be like the, the longest and the most best Slayer guide. You guys will see every single task I do and how much experience an hour it is. Pretty good idea. That's why I set this up right here. That the Slayer thingy, this experience thing area up here. Um, I'm going to use that so every task I can see how much Slayer experience I get and we'll time every task as well so we can kind of calculate the experience per hour. What you know about making one big Slayer guy? Now I have a little something special that I do have in my bank that I'm going to be using for some Slayer experience, alright? It's called 20 Effigies. Yeah, well, you wish. This task actually brings in a lot of essence. I got a thousand rune essence, pure essence, whatever, in 20 minutes. Like, that's faster than you would be getting it if you were to be mining it. That's, that's kind of interesting, I don't know. Okay, so pure essence are 81 each. Oh my god. 81 each. Oh my god. Look, look what I fucking did the Armadol runes, man. Look, what the fuck? I did pissed off number one boss. Oh, that's so gay. That's a 1.7 gauge. Nothing better than getting the spin ticket drop. Oh yeah, good advertising. Now we're going to play this right after. Come on. Come on. Kill it. I want to check what I win. Oh, it's got like full HP. Come on. Hit, hit your thousand that you normally hit. Why are you... My character's nervous on video. There we go. Okay, there we go. Spin. Ah, oh, can't wait for it to... Why the hell did that pop up there? I don't fucking know it's right. Okay. Oh, win! So precious. Oh yeah, that's a going right to Slayer. Oh yeah. <laughs> 40.6k Slayer gain in 30 minutes exactly, no problem. Alright, we have a 4 minute clip on a 1 Slayer task thing. We can't be doing this. So, I'm gonna go listen to some music and when I'm done I'll continue. Alright, so I'm basically at 35k Slayer experience in total, without the lamp, obviously, and it's been exactly 9.16am, so it's been exactly 45 minutes, yeah? Okay, yeah, 45 minutes, so that's not bad. I used, to think that, I used to think this task was like, you know, 30k Slayer an hour or some shit, and then I just started to actually calculate it, and it's like, at least 45, so this is actually one of the really great tasks out there. Now, it also used to drop you a lot of effigies. I used to call these things effigy poopers, man. These things dropped a lot of effigies. Uh, but now that there's, you know, nuke, or not nuke, but nerf, we got fucked over. We got bent over and fucked over by Jagex. 
I actually never realized that this cape right here, the uh, tux, desire cape, whatever the fucking, the rhino cape that used to be a rhino cape, now it's like a trim completionist cape. I, does it actually work here as a fire cape? I, I mean, I guess that makes sense completely because, you know, you basically do kill Jad like 30 fucking times, but that's kind of, I never really knew that. Actually, I thought you had to wear a fire cape. See, there's a smart Jax update that they find. You know, just common sense, you know, you don't have to wear the fire cape. If you have the upgraded one, you can use that. Good job, Jax. You finally use your brain. All right, it's my last one, so we're gonna get a quick Slayer task, and I think I'm gonna do my Magic Tree Run. I do have to do that, it is 9.20 a.m., and I want to be able to do them before I go to bed tonight, so I'm gonna do them now, and see you guys then. Okay, new task. Come on. Come on, new task, please. Blood, blood, yes! Woo! That's a fucking sexy task. All right, now, here's the thing I'm gonna show you guys that I was talking about before, that's, like, you know, 20 FHGs in my bank. And See, I cannot play in HD. This is fucking leggy as shit. Uh, minimum. There we go. Like, people say direct X and all that other, but fuck it, the minimum is good enough, okay, let's go. Uh, what do you need for magic to pay for the, oh, you need some cock, there we go. Alright, so here it is, right here, guys, it's called the reward, but I did my troll invasion yesterday, it's almost, well, not really, it's like the middle of the month, basically, but yeah. Look how much Slayer we get, 77.6k Slayer. Holy shit, holy, 133k Slayer today. Now I use this teleport to get myself to the, um, Taverly whatever thing. Oh, I think I went to the wrong one. Fuck. Okay, I did. Okay, okay. We're not doing our palm she run. We're doing. Wait, I think my packet's about to die. Let me get all that shit in there. Oh, there's nothing there. All right, Taverly, that's the one that I go to. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. So okay. Ah, four hundred and six thousand experience today, and it hasn't even been. Oh wait, 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 wait. We gotta set this up for our Slayer. So there we go. Okay. Now, hopefully, there's no one in this world. Please, please, please. All right, here we go. This task time. Pretty sure I do have blood buds. Unless I read it wrong. Uh, it's 145. Okay, so it is 9.28 in the morning. Um, let's move it over. So it's almost been an hour I've been on. I've gotten, you know, 135k slayer experience. How pro am I? All right, so here we go. Just as my overload runs out. Yeah, there we go. Um, now it's been 15 minutes. I've gotten 18 point, basically 5k slayer. So times 18.5k by 4. This is like 75k an hour. See, I don't know if this task is better than um, Dagonos or not. I mean, I, I think I prefer this over Dagonos mostly because um, it's simple and it's just, I think it's more experience overall, it feels like, and you get a better chance of effigies, obviously. Same charms, but um, I don't know. I prefer this over Dagonos, to be honest. Plus, you don't see your character running all over the map the whole time. It's kind of annoying. But Dagonos, you do get those nice torso seeds. I got two torso seeds yesterday from there. I was like, holy shit, I pasted the balls and everything. Alright guys, I'm overloading now, I only have 10 left, so it's been exactly, what is that, 35 minutes, so, so 35 minutes, 44k Slayer, that's a fucking good task. Shit, that's a good task, man. If you had Blood Belts all day, man, you could get like, 1.4 mil Slayer in like 20 hours. Like, what the fuck? Alright, there we go, task complete, probably took me 36 minutes, I don't know. Charms, uh, give me, okay, task done, let's go, where's my ring? Wait. Oh, I forgot my ferocious ring, didn't I? Show you guys the time quickly. 10.05 a.m. Oh, yeah. Not bad. Okay. New task time. Um, <laughs> this is a good... Fuck, don't drop it. Come on. Good. This is a good day. All right. So we're going to reset this. Set up Slayer. Reset. Put this here. Okay. So it is 10.07 in the morning. Let's go. Fucking mod swearing at me and shit, man. What the fuck is reported? Well, here we go. We got two more. This task basically took me a little bit less than 45 minutes as I just overloaded recently. So, uh, 40, I don't know, we'll say two minutes. So, it is basically 60k an hour almost. It's probably around, uh, we'll go with 59.99k. All right, here we go. Let's go. New task. Ringy. Holy shit, my cannon just destroyed that thing. I would totally kill it, but meh. I'll be back for the next time. Okay, so new task is Hellhound. That's a good one. Okay. Actually, I think we have the right inventory besides the Iron Titan. Fuck. No. Is this the maze? Oh. Fuck you. Nothing like pissing off the legit players you guys have fucking left. And when I say legit, I don't mean like, I'm legit, yo. I'm so sick. I, I mean like legit like I don't bot like you guys, hopefully. Actually, I, I know I have a few subscribers that bot. Open the fucking door. Fucking run. There we go. What's he get? 73%? 70, oh, right at 72. Fuck. Oh, yeah. 3,000 feathers. Fucking. Let me quickly dismiss this yak. 
get out of here. Iron Titan, where are you? There you are. Please say I have enough points. There we go. Oh, Iron Arrows, too. How many? Oh. Now this is the spell we use to get here. Just go to quickly Cathbury and just run south. Let's go. For fuck's sake, I always do Cathbury. I meant Travely. Fucking damn it. You know why? It's because I'm so hungry. It's 11 o'clock, all right? I eat 3,000 calories a day. It's 11 o'clock. I haven't had a single drop of anything but water yet, so I'm hungry. Actually, to give you an update on that, I told my mom, well, I gave my mom money to buy me a sub and to buy herself a coffee. That's the way you help people get you stuff. You're like, hey, if you get me this, I'll get you this. And it's like, you know, $1.50 for a coffee, and it's like $7 a sub, so whatever. See, if I didn't offer the coffee, she'd be like, fuck, nine, nah, get that shit for you. You offer the coffee, she's like, oh, sure, I'll do it for you. Thank you, son, you're awesome. It's like, mom, fuck you, you ain't doing shit for me. Please don't be anybody here. Thank you. Oh, I'm trying to get, like, you guys know, this is back when I used to, like, slay really hardcore. Even though I kind of am now, but anyways. Um, I used to try to get six hour logged in the morning, and then, like, I basically have the next 24 hours just to uh, skill as much as I want, and it, this is not the right spot, is it? Okay, fuck. Uh, we'll just leave it here and see if it works. That's that's how I do it. But anyways, what you do is you get six hour logged, and then you um, you basically have 24 hours of play, and then that adds on to your daily experience. So I have 220k Slayer unlocked. That means on my daily RuneScape tracker experience, I'm gonna have an extra 220k Slayer um, prior to having the obviously 24 hours of play. I'm not saying I'm gonna play 30 hours or 24 hours straight. I'm just I'm just saying like you know when I wake up tomorrow. I have a good amount of time to still slay. All I gotta do is log out before I log out this morning. So, you know, if I log out in two hours, I gotta make sure tomorrow morning I log out like an hour and like 59 minutes. Well, you know, from now. But it's kind of hard to do with Slayer because, you know, you do have to hop sometimes. Unless you're a fucking faggot bitch. No, no, I, I, I'm serious. If I have subscribers, I don't even care if you're a subscriber. If you don't hop when people slay, I don't care if I block you, if I piss you off. Because you piss me off in the return, so I don't, I don't give a shit. So many times I've been crashed at Blood Bells and even this Hellhounds. It's just like, why do you do it? It's just like, dude, there's so many Hellhounds here. Like, come on, we can both put up our cannon. It's like, how about you just fucking take 20 seconds out of your fucking day and hop, and there you go. Now we get double the experience per hour, and you don't have to fuck me over. So anyways, I decided to take down a few, well, I put up a few of my videos on private, because I figured, you know what, this is going to be my 500 video. I hope it's not my 501st because I do have one video ready to go upload, but I'm pretty sure that'll be my 499th. Um, which my 499th video was like three days ago, but I put uh, yeah, I took down a few videos. Yep, yep. Got to make a special 500 video, and then I'll put them back up. And it's like the next day there's like 510 videos. In reality, this is like my public 700th video. If you were to count every single video I ever made on any account, wait, if you include Pornhub, like 900th video. Anyways, my friend was telling me that um, in beta, the sl the slaying iron or steel dragons are actually just about 100k experience an hour right now. I'm not really sure exactly what they were doing, if they are doing magic or not. But someone said they made a thread. Maybe they made a video. I'm not really sure. If I do find it, I'll make sure I link you guys. But um, yeah, now I'm getting kind of curious. Like, should I even be slaying right now? The only reason I'm slaying is, you know, I'm, I mean, I know slayers going to be faster in beta. But um, I'm kind of curious towards, like, you know, how much work is it going to be compared to this? Um, and stuff like that. So that's why I'm kind of doing it now. I, I, I might stop at 104 million. I'm currently 91.8. By the time I upload this, it'll probably be like 93 or something. But yeah, after 104 mil or so, I'll probably take a break, which is, you know, if you guys don't know, that's basically what level 120 is. So, you know, if they were to make stats go to 120, I'd have 120 Slayer. Um, yeah, I'll probably take a break then. I'm not really sure what I'm going to do. I might go back to Rune Span, to be honest. I know you guys don't like Rune Span videos, but I'm 17 mil till. I'm pretty sure I could finish that before summer ends. So I could be 100 mil Runecraft. Maybe I got 104 mil room crafted, but that'd be kind of nice. And I'll have 104 mil slate, so that's pretty sexy. Anyway, let's show you guys the quick time right now. It is 11:03. As I, well, I said recently, it's like a 10 something. Um, so 11:03, and we're at 226k Slayer. We started at what was it, 920 something? Nine? I don't know. Although we have gotten like what 77k experience from the book, 17k from the lamp. That so that was that's that's what 94k XP. But you know what, that makes me 130k Slayer today in the past, like, what, it's been probably two hours? Not even two hours. Well, no, it must have been two hours at least. I woke up at 8.30, didn't I? 8, nah, 8.30, not 9.30. Or 8, 8, 4, uh, fuck it. You just go back to starting. I'm mad, bro, I'm mad, I'm mad. Okay, this guy just walks in here and, he, well, I guess he's subscribed to me, but he walks in here and takes a stab at a few hellhounds, and I noticed I only have 58 Slayer experience per one piece. Isn't that so dumb how it's set up? Like, you, you do, you hit like a three on a Hellhound, and you get half the Slayer experience that the guy that killed the whole thing does. Like, how does that even fucking work at all? 
it's basically like taking the credit for somebody else's work, you know, like, you get some bitch to do your homework for you or some smart nerd, and then you fucking get famous because of, like, the story that he wrote, and it's like, it's his story, but you got famous, it's like, fuck you, man, you just took my sh I don't care if you took my lunch money, that was my story I wrote, you asshole. Anyways, I forgot to reset my Slayer experience up there, um, but anyways, this is 60k an hour, it's, it's, believe me, it's fast as shit, that's why I do it. Really boring, I mean, it's shitty charms as well, but it's 60k an hour. And our next tech, cow fights. Oh yeah, we got, we're getting some good, oh, the cow fights might be busy. Now, the thing I hate about this task is, I think it is like 50 or 60k an hour, but like, it could be so much faster, they just spawn a little bit faster. I forget exactly where it was. It was around here. Desert near Cow Fight Lair. That's the one right there. B-I-Q. And you run south, and it's right over here. Rock. Climb down. Isn't that odd? You just right-click a rock, and you can climb down. Like, how do you climb down this? Like, there's nothing. Oh, it's empty. Yes. Yeah, I'm happy, bro. Big boner right now. This reminds me of where we ended our live stream, because our Skype started to fuck up. Anyways, I'm going to answer a few questions on the Skype, or... On the live stream, um, obviously I'm going to plan to have more. Uh, just right now, I, I mean, making a video like this isn't too bad. You know, I get to take a little break throughout my time. Like, if you guys wouldn't mind something like a live stream where I put on, like, some free whatever copyrighted music and just kind of slave and you guys can kind of watch that while you escape. I, wouldn't, I would not mind at all doing that, but um, there wouldn't really be much audio. In fact, I might take off my mic just in case my mom starts to talk to me or some shit and get, like, some messages like, holy shit, show us your mom, show us her tits or some shit like that. Which now that is disrespect. Number one boss talking about disrespect. When he makes a video of his title like, Big Booty Bitches is my title in the next video. Okay, how many hours left? Or 42 minutes, not bad. But yeah, if you guys are still watching, you know, 15 or so minutes, um, do leave a comment if you guys would like me to live stream, maybe with just like copyrighted music, free copyrighted music, non cop whatever the fuck, music that I can use in my video. Um, and you guys will just enjoy watching that. Or, I don't know, you guys can mute it and just watch me if you want to listen to your own music. Um... But yeah, I, I don't like sitting there talking for like five hours for a live stream. Unless like, you know, we have a huge Skype call kind of going. Which get annoying in my opinion because like everyone's starting to talk over each other. It's just kind of annoying. Um, but yeah, talking for like five hours is not that fun. Fuck, we forgot to reset our Slayer experience. and every Okay, whatever. I guess fuck that. We're just going to... I will tell you guys the experience if I remember them. That's, we'll go with that. Cow fights, one mil Slayer experience an hour. There you go. Anyways, I want to talk a little bit of a topic that, well, I'm going to talk about whatever the fuck I want to talk about. But anyways, I have a really friend that I've said um, that I want, he wanted to start making videos, and he tried to make, like, his first one, like, uh, I don't know, a few weeks ago. Um, and I guess, I mean, this is kind of the answer to a few of your questions as well, that's why I'm saying this. Um, to make it, like, I mean, he said for him it was kind of odd, like, he's not a shy person, he's normal, he's like, oh, like that good shit, right, whatever. He's smoking that good shit. Uh, but when he finds, when he makes a commentary video and he's just sitting there, he doesn't really know what to talk about, he doesn't really know what to say, and he's, it's kind of weird, he says, like, it's kind of awkward, because he's, like, talking to the computer kind of thing. Like, when he talks with us on Skype, it's normal, but when he talks by himself, um, making a video, he said it kind of sounds weird. And, yeah, that is one thing that you guys do have to get used to, any, any of you guys that want to start making videos. I get a lot of inboxes saying, hey, man, can you go check out my videos? I'm, I'm starting out commentating and stuff like that, and... Um, can you check it out? I do on the occasion check them out, but I mean, like, it's a lot to check out when you get, like, you know, 10 inboxes a day on that, and it's just like, oh, man. Like, you know, like, I, I didn't have any help whenever I first started out on YouTube. I didn't get no shout-out. I didn't buy no shout-out. I didn't do anything. I just slowly got up there, and now I am where I am, so, you know, it's pretty good. Although I will admit, I did get about, like, five subscribers from commenting on, like, Sparked Max channel. Hey, guys, I make commentaries. Check out my video. Yeah, I still see people doing that, but um, that's what I used to do as a, just a joke, but I guess I got five subscribers from that, and people enjoyed it, so... I mean, people will find her channel from other people, or from just something, and uh, it'll happen. But it is hard to start out, but, yeah, as for the commentating thing, um, it, I mean, you get used to it, that's all I can say. I used, I used to find it to be really weird, you know, because back then, people would judge you on your voice. Like, if you sound fat, they'd be like, oh my god, you're so fat, and if you don't make a real-life video, you're fat, on, like, automatically you're fat, they've never seen a picture. Ask for what to talk about, just talk about anything you want. That's what I kind of do, and people seem to enjoy it. Um, obviously, I do try to talk more about... Actually, I don't really talk much about RuneScape, except for the fact that like I'm playing it. But besides that, I just talk about booty and shit, and big bitches. Just find a topic and have fun with it, and that's you know that's basically all the tip I can give you. I don't really know what else to say for that. Oh, and the best time to make a commentary is when no one's in the house. That's, just, that's a big tip for you. That I find that... I still find it weird to make a commentary when people are home, because it's like... You don't really want them to hear you, because, like, they think, like, 
what kind of a loser is my son, man? He's talking to the computer like all day down there and I'm up here watching TV. It's, you know, I don't feel kind of weird. Like as you can tell right now that my voice, no one's home right now. So it's a good time to make a video. For God's sake. Like something happened to my computer. I don't think my audio is really working. I hope this is recording. But anyways, look, it says fucking look, the can't. I couldn't load plugin. Anyways, my audio is not working for for right now, so I think I'm gonna have to restart my computer. Maybe I have to. See, I don't want to restart my computer because I want to get a bunch of Slayer experience unlogged. But I want to watch a movie. I'm freaking bored here, man. I want to watch something. That's another thing I hate about the live streaming part is like you can't watch anything. You you it'll be copyrighted, right? So can't watch porn. Well, maybe you can't. Well, you can hear. I don't know. Could, could I upload a video with just like porn in the background? Like just the volume of it, just the audio of porn, just like, uh, uh, all the moaning and shit, but not show the actual video? I better ask Machinima if I can do that. I'll just tell them, well, it's not really copyrighted, right? Because, I mean, I don't know. I mean, I'm sure the people that made the porn video wouldn't mind because I'm giving them publicity, which might make them more money, so I'm, I'm going to check this out. That's actually pretty fun. Imagine just listening to a video and all it is is just moaning and it's the porn, but it's just, it's just someone playing RuneScape. <laughs> I'd be, you know what, one of you guys that have, uh, that don't have partnership, go do that right now, that'd be awesome. I will like the video, I swear, inbox me a video of you playing RuneScape with, like, audio of porn in the background, and I, I will like your video, and it will get views, and it'll be cool, and it'll probably be taken down within a few hours, but it'll be cool. And before I get, like, 30 inboxes of, like, hey, watch my porn video. No, Lamar, I will not watch your porn video, I don't roll that way, fucking four guys and shit. Even if you had one chick, I still wouldn't do that, like, ew. I would never do a threesome with two guys. I'm, I'm, the, I'm that type of guy. My bad. And then you get the guys. I think they're cool with like like four guys and like two chicks. It's like, that's not hot. That's disgusting. The moment, there, the moment there's more dicks than pussy around, I'm running the fuck out of that room. You see? This isn't a RuneScape topic. I'm making a RuneScape video. You see? You guys don't have to talk about RuneScape the whole time. Well, it's either the moment there's more dicks than pussy or there's hair on the pussy. That you, run, you run the fuck away. That kind of reminds me, like, you know, back in the day, it wasn't really believed to be much of... There was not much shaving back in the day, right? Because I had to watch a video when I um, was in parenting class during the last year. Um, and, yeah, we had to watch a video where they give birth, and it was like a 1999 film, or like a something around there. I think it was... I think it was... Um, I think it was taken in the UK. Like, I think the setting was the UK. I'm not really sure, but it, I'm pretty sure it was UK people because they had the little accent kind of thing. Um, when they were um, moaning, I think. It was like, oh! I just made fun of UK people doing that moan, didn't I? Okay, well, the moaning was, who the fuck is calling me? The moaning was different or something. I don't really... I can't fucking talk with a... Shut up, please. Ah, there we go. Okay. Um, what was I saying? Yeah. And, yeah, we had to watch the video, and it, there was not one single shaved vagina. And that's just... I, I would feel so bad for the doctor. Ugh. Seriously, if I was a doctor that had to give, like, you know, take the baby out and shit, I would make sure that she's shaved. If she's not, I would bring my own razor. As the head's coming out, just start shaving it, like, fucking dirty bitch. Oh, that's a disgusting image in my head. Let's get off the topic. Thumbs up if you enjoy sex vagina talk. Yeah. See, this is something I can never say when my mom is home, because she will totally hear me. I can tell sometimes when my mom's, like, listening to me, because, like, she changes the channel, but she, like, mutes it. Like, she changes the channel, and then she mutes it. I'm sitting here thinking, you know, she's just changing the channel. Because once you change a channel um, on um, satellite, it doesn't, the audio doesn't start right away. It starts in a few seconds. Uh, and then it just stops completely. I'm just like, mom totally muted the, the, the TV and she's listening to me. So I just pause the video and stop talking. I'm just like, come on, put the TV back on. And once it goes on, I start talking again. And it mutes again. She's like, mom, fucking fuck off. I'm trying to make a video. You know what I kind of hate, though, when I, as a video maker, I've experienced... I always experience that at the starting of the video, it's actually normally the most boring part of the video. And then, like, at least for me, it is, right? And then as I start getting used to talking and stuff like that, I start doing different things and talking a little more funny, let's just say. I mean, at the starting of the video, I think I was just like, hey, guys, it's time to... My moment's home. You hear? See? Uh, okay, anyways, I will be back in a second. I got my sub right here. Just joking, that's my dick. It's my neon plastic dick. Yes, it is. Oh, by the way, guys, feel free to uh, to pause the video and go get some food in real life. Yeah, feel free. The video will be right here when you get back. Or maybe order a pizza. Mmm, pizza with cheese and uh, extra cheese. Triple cheese, please. Ooh, task complete. Oh, my titan just killed that thing. Okay, new task. Um, I'm gonna get... Uh, Griff, no, thank you. If it was Ganos, I'd probably do it, but not that. Okay, task. 
That's like my first task to cancel it, isn't it, in this whole video? Living around. I used to do these, but no thank you. Those are fucking boring now. Um, okay, new task. Oh, okay, this is. Oh, 68, not 69? Please, 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 please. Uh, sh ah, alright, so my mom left to go do an oil change. That reminds me. You guys ever watch B. Go in here. You guys ever watch BMS? I think I linked you guys like a long time ago. I told you guys I watched like a million times. Oil changes. Who remembers that? No, no, no. I, I want to know for real. Who here would ever do a real life oil change? If you guys know what I'm talking about, you gotta watch BMS. Blue Mountain State Series. Oh. No way, there's already two people here. No. Any left. Please don't. Get off me. Wait, how is there all four? These guys are slow. They're not even turmoiling or something. Okay, come on, come on, come on. Please don't tell me. 51, that's a lot. Ah, shit. I'm at the hop. No, I'm not gonna. I'm gonna do the other ones maybe. The ones that can cannon. Okay. I want to thank this guy. He hopped for me because I told him I, I can't really hop, and he said he could hop. So, thank you, buddy, for being a good hero. And this fucking iron dragon still wants my fucking dick. You can fuck off. Somebody needs to go kill that fucking dragon. Anyways, I, I thought about this. You know how everyone says, you know, oh, I have my sub like this, like with all these different toppings and all these different sauces. I'm going to tell you guys how I have mine, all right? So today I got, you know, Subway, right? I got the steak and cheese one, whatever it's called. Um... It's a sub of the day for now, so, um, you know, that's what I got. Anyways, um, so I got on it lettuce, tomato, and olives. I don't really like olives too much, but, you know, they're kind of good. So it gives it a little bit of flavor. Um, I got it on uh, eight wheat bread, toasted with natural Swiss. And now this is my sauce right here, all right? This is my sauce. Cum. I'm just joking. Okay. Barbecue mayo, which is basically cum, um, and ranch. Probably the most fattening sauces you could ever put on there, but it makes it that much better. I hate when people go... Oh, that's so unhealthy. Those sauces are so bad for you. It's just like, you're eating a fucking thousand calories. What's the difference if you add an extra hundred? Like, on, make it that much better and add an extra hundred calories and make it test, taste ten times better. Add it to that 269 XP drop. Anyways, um, yeah, that's the way I look at it. I mean, when I go and eat shit, I eat shit. I don't, I don't eat half shit. I eat, I eat the full shit when I eat shit, okay? Shit. Anyways, I'm pretty sure this task is like around 30, no, I think it was actually almost 40k an hour with um, Storm of Armadale. It's a little bit faster with uh, our Storm of Armadale versus the Rapier, but obviously these runes right now are 1.7k. I think I got these for 1.8 actually, I put them up to 5%, I got a little bit of money back, so probably close to 1.8. Um, I hope they crash back down, I have, I have no idea why they went back up so much, like... They were like 1.5k each normal, I, and I, I'm not making them rise, I promise you guys. Like, myself, I'm not using 20,000 of them. I'm using, like, maybe 1,000 a day at the most, so, um, or maybe 1,500 at the most. So, I mean, I don't really mind paying 1.7, it's just kind of annoying knowing that, like, I could have got them for 1.1. Like, you know, if I had money, like, I, I recently sold a bunch of herbs, that's why my cash pile is up a little bit, right? I sold a bunch of my herbs, and I, and I bought myself my arcane, my friend let me the Virtus, but, um... Right now, like right now, it's just like fuck. Like that's so much extra money. But I, I would have bought a lot more before for 1.1k each. I just didn't have any money at the time. Uh, it was all stocked away and stuff. But you know, whatever. Now you guys know what I like to do when I make long videos, right? If you guys have watched this far, which is half of it, I think. Um, comment below. Um, I love Slayer. We I told you guys to comment that a long time ago on the other Slayer video, which by the way has like 3,000 likes and like 120,000 views because I'm featuring it. But it had like 80,000 by itself, which is fucking awesome. Um, I would that's that's the type of video I love to make. It's a long video. People enjoy it. They love it. It gets a great amount of views and ratings and everything. Everything's perfect. So um, comment I love Slayer and if you haven't yet liked the video, baby, please. Oh, by the way, possibly if I if I remember at the end of this video, I will show you guys my Slayer tab uh, with all the drops I've received. Um, I have sold a bit, as I said before, to get my cash up a little bit before I sold my herbs because I wanted to buy those armadillo runes. Um, but it's uh, it's looking pretty good besides some of the small stuff I've sold. I have a lot of rune full helms, I think, rune helms. A lot of the rune limbs I just banked. I got um, a lot of this little shit that's kind of interesting. So, yeah, I'll show you guys if I remember. If I don't, um, I might be making a video later on anyways in the future after I get like 10 mil Slayer in like a month and just show my Slayer tab. But that's, you know, we'll see what happens. Ah. Uh. This guy's not gonna hop. Great. I know I'm an asshole for not hopping, but I, I asked, uh, you know, if, if they. If, great, he's not gonna hop. And then he tells me he likes my videos. That means you must hop if you like my videos. That means you cannot stay here. Yes, good boy, I think he hopped. Anyways, I basically could have I could have done a slay day today. I don't really want to because I don't know if really. I mean, it's during the week right now. But um, 
I think I might be having possibly a slay day this weekend, maybe. Um, if you want to play 24 hours, you can. It's kind of embarrassing when, like, the person that's hosting it doesn't play the whole time. But, I mean, how about we make it a 12-hour slay day, and if you choose to keep going, you can. Which I probably will, just not for 24 hours. But, yeah, I do want to motivate people right now that aren't 99 Slayer, that aren't whatever experience I do want, to start slaying now before the beta does come. It will be different, but it will be a lot more work. It could be faster, but, I mean... There's nothing wrong with the way I mind training Slayer right now, so... I gotta burp. Okay, maybe... I need every single one of my subscribers to be 99 Slayer. That, that'd be cool. Everyone's 99 Slayer. We're all legit, 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 legit Slayer Master Pros. You know what would be a cool update? I can see this happening in the future. See, this is such a cool update. You guys, about, I'm about to tell you guys. See, I imagine they made skills go to 120, right? Since beta's coming out, you know, I've seen people kill people... Wearing full armor doll or full rune and like versus full tour, but the guy at rune wins. Why? Because he knows how to how to fight, right? So I'm thinking, you know, if you really made stats go to 120, you wouldn't really be a big difference, would it? I mean, I bet you somebody in rune could probably still kill someone in Torva with 120 stats, possibly if the guy is really bad at you know multi or what, PKing or whatever, um, person versus person. Um, but, like, you know, imagine they did bring skills to 120. Um, now, some retard, I don't know why, this makes no sense. Some retard commented a long time ago in my video. It's like, they can't take a skill that's already on the on the game and turn it to level 120. It's just like, how the fuck does that make any sense at all? Why, why could they not make it to go to 120? Like, I just, you, know, you don't have to start a skill from level 1 and then let it go to 120. You can start from any level and let it go to any level you want. But anyways, um... So yeah, I wanted them to make like, imagine 120 Slayer, right? 120 Slayer is like 104 million experience, and at 120 Slayer, you can like start to choose your own Slayer tasks, right? Imagine how cool that would be, right? Not too many people in this game would have 120 anyways, right? But it's kind of like Dungeoneering, right? Once you get full, once you get full, um, what's it called, uh, prestige at Dungeoneering at level 120, it becomes obviously a lot faster than level 100, right? Level 100 Dungeoneering is so much faster than level 120, I mean so much slower because of the prestige and the floors, right? Now imagine they could do that with something like Slayer, right? You get to choose your own task, or you get to choose ten Slayer tasks every day of your of your own choice. But it can't be the same, and in like every every two tasks can't be the same, or something like that. So you know, people don't just pick blood belts all day, right? Because then you're not gonna find a world. I would probably pick something like you know Water Fiends. I do Water Fiends like four times in a day, and then I do a couple other tasks, you know, whatever. But that'd be, like, such a nice, cool update, I think. You know, maybe, maybe for thieving, right? There's, like, another another room in Pyramid Plunder, but you are able to uh, go there instantly. Like, you know how in Pyramid Plunder, you gotta go, you start from fucking floor one or room one, whatever it's called, then you get yourself to room seven and then room eight. Imagine we're, or maybe they don't have to add a new room. Just let us start right at room seven. You enter the pyramid, and it says, which room would you like to start in? You say room seven or room eight. Now, at this ratio, it's probably just worth it just to go to room 8, do it, get out, do room 8, get out. But, like, how cool would that be? A level, like, 120 dungeon, or 120 uh, thieving, or some type of level, or something. I don't know, like, that'd just be so cool. And it's a type of thing, like, dungeoneering, obviously, you want to strive for the cape, first of all. Having the max prestige and doing the max floor. So every level is kind of different, right? If they did that with every other skill, like, everybody would want to get their levels up. Which means, Jagex, people might buy more spins, Jagex. Look at that. Smart update, Jax. Make, make skills go to 120. People will start buying 120 Slayer. People will start buying... What a smart up. Come on, Jax. You can't refuse, man. And I know y'all want some money, so there's a good money idea. Work on some... Now, nah, this might take a long time for them to be able to come up with all that content for skills go to 120, but think about all the money after, Jax. Think about all the money you can make after. People will be buying their skills at 120. That's like 20 grand or some shit. Not to mention the high scores would look really nice. I think if every skill went to 120, like, it would look really nice on the high scores because you'll get people on top page. Like, when Dungeoneering first came out, right, you'll get people on top page that are, like, 20 levels lower than each other, but they're still on top page because, like, I'm just Dungeoneering or something. Not 20 levels below, but, like, five or six levels, right? The first two would be, like, the highest there is total so far that people can get. Oh, not people can get, but the highest. He just fucking attacked my piece of shit. Anyways, um... And then you get things like, at the bottom, there's people like five levels lower. But imagine if skills went to 120, how fucking sick that would be. Like, the top page would have like, I don't know what the fuck the total max would be, but um, people would be like 100 total level of difference, and they'd still be on the top page. That's kind of interesting. And that also might motivate people to train other skills so they get the total level up faster, which also means more spins buying. Jagex, look at this great idea. I want some money, by the way. If you guys do this, Jagex, 
I want some money for giving you guys the greatest idea for the game. I feel like this guy is killing them fast. Oh, yeah, he has D. Yeah, D clouds are really helpful. I remember when I used to come here, try hard mode with spec restores and D clouds. And actually, I might still do that. I used to bring a pack. Where's his, where's his pack yak? I used to bring a pack yak full of prayer pots and then my inventory would be like full um, restore potions. Maybe I'll actually try that. Um, see, I'll, maybe I'll try that in the future uh, to see how much experience you do get because extra. Oh, wait, Karasi's better than D claws here, aren't they? I think. Yeah, I think they are. Maybe I'll try Karasi here too. Now, I never had Karasi until just recently, by the way. I, I had all my Slayer experience before Karasi. Well, I never had it. I, I recently got Karasi ever since I got my completion escape because, um, you know, I had to do all the quests and. That was a really boring quest, man. Those quests, for, and to, to unlock the quest to do Crossy, it's just, uh, there's a quest coming out soon, actually. I think this week or next week or something. By the time I upload it, it's probably this week. I don't really know, but, um, yeah, it's coming out, so good fight, Completion Escape. Gotta go do a quest. That sucks. That's the worst part of Completion Escape, man. You gotta keep up with it. Oh, that's a really easy part, you know. I can't complain. Keeping up with a Completion Escape when you already have one is really easy, right? It's just a few extra hours here and there, but getting one... Oh, it's so hard to get one nowadays, man. Holy shit. I can't imagine how much new shit they're going to be adding. I still have 21 of these things. What the fuck? This is kind of slow, it feels like. Oh! Effigy! Yes! These things are awesome effigy droppers, but since, you know, this is my 10th effigy now. This is my 10th effigy in 4.5 mil slayer, aka um, 4 mil slayer since I got 10 effigies now. Um, which means I'm getting an effigy every 400k slayer, so... That's the current ratio, I guess, but I am doing pretty high. Um, open this up. Nice. Steaming. It's a pretty good start. Pretty good start. Uh, um, the fuck? Okay. We're the one that, okay. Come on. Open up. Open up. Open up. Uh, next one. Oh, fuck. I hate that. That's like the worst fucking one ever. Like fire making and cooking. That's just stupid. Um, yes. Summoning. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. 25 keys. That's nice. That's like fucking a lot of crimsons. What's this one? Agility! Ah! Jabrim! You can suck my dick, yes! That's like fucking 500 laps of that stupid course, thank you, okay. Ah! Sexy! Woo! Look at that Oh, agility, 20, 25 million and 30,000 slayers getting there. So we are officially at 328,000 slayer experience unlogged. That's pretty fucking sick! How much should we get now? We got 48k from the FG, we got 77k from the book, and we got 17k from the other thing, so... How much is that? Like 150? Half my Slayer experience came from, like, bullshit. <laughs> That's kind of odd. But yeah, after today, like I said, I'm going to be using it on Agility from now on, I think. I, I just want to see how much Slayer I can get in a day. Um, not no I think completely, but sort of. Like, I'm, I'm going to be playing quite a bit. Um, it's only 12.10 right now. Probably going to play for the next 12 hours, maybe. Although I do plan on going out for a little bit later on, so that might, you know, that might ruin my experience per hour, you know. Oh, wait. Got to go to my Twitter. Got to update my Twitter. Tweet. 10 effigies. Ah. There we go. See, I always update. See, go like. Oh, by the way, my Twitter is on my. If you go to my YouTube page, you'll see it right there. If I never put it in the description, I will, but I probably won't. We're getting a good amount of charms for this. Look at that. 75, 42, 3 blues. That's fucking shit. Now, I had 22,700 Arbindal runes when I got here, I think. So I've used almost 500. I have 10 left. Probably will end up using a little over 500 for uh, 84 kills. Which is less than 10 per kill, I think. About less than 10 per kill. Something like that. So basically, it's costing me 17k to kill one Steel Dragon. Which ain't even that bad, to be honest. I mean, yeah, it's not too bad. Now, if I was on the other prayer right here, yeah, I'd be killing these in like five. Five fucking... Oh, that'd be sick. I might actually try slaying um, in the future with that type of prayer on. Just, you know, doing a lot more mage tasks, hopefully. Because um, there are things that are still, like, I can still mage them, it's just I'm not really doing it right now because I, I do want to get my melee. I mean, I don't want to get 200 round magic off Slayer, that's just stupid. That's a chilly move right there. Anyways, at the end of this month, I think I, sh I might reach pretty close to, like, fucking 40-something thousand green charms. Which, with the bonus, I think they're 132 experience each, something like that. Um, I don't do unicorns for greens, I don't think it's worth the money, it's just, it's really expensive and I really don't have that much to spend. Okay, well, I do if you see my cash pile, but that's, I'm going to be investing that. So, well, I'm investing it on a different item than herbs because I feel like herbs might not rise as much as I thought they would. But, yeah, if, like, I mean, I think it's, like, I forget how much GP and XP it is for unicorns, but for making what I'm going to be making is just fruit bats, those things are very fucking cheap. Is this my last one because I won't have the anti-fire? Three more and my anti-fire is going to run. I hate when this happens, man. It always happens. There's never a time when, like, 
my anti-fire runs out right after my Slayer Tats. It always runs out right before when I have to do it. 45 Crimsons. That's actually a fuck lot of... How much time? This took me 20 minutes. That's it. That's fast, I think, right? 20 minutes for 84 Steel Dragons, 220 experience each. What is that, 17 or 18k Slayer in 20 min... What the fuck? Is this right? No, I must have... No, I think I summoned this a little bit after I started my... Yeah, because I had like four rune limbs in my... Okay. I was about to say, these are like 50k an hour, man. Holy shit, I almost got a boner. And there's the last one right there. Okay, two tasks away from 3,600. Uh, anything that green charm's nice. Okay, let's go. Let's get the new task. I'm not, I'm not going to teleport there. I'm just going to run there. Oh, wait, 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 wait. We have to be a cheap ass. Rune Helm. Dragon Bones. Okay. Pray those. And bank that. Even though we're just about to go to the bank right now. Okay, that was a stupid move. That Rune Helm basically paid for half of killing one Steel Dragon. I basically need 170 fucking Rune Helms for that one Slayer task. And... Ugh, no thank you. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. <sighs> More living fucking rocks? Okay, cancel. How many points I have? 16.5. Wow, okay. That's a fuck lot of points. Um, I sh uh, These are boring, but okay. Mage XP for the win. I'm ready my mage gear, so that helps. Now I want to quickly do our jack of trades. Can't forget to do this. Ah, 10 out of 10 skills done. Alright, here we go. 10k Slayer for free. For like one minute of work. Totally worth it. Like 5 mil Slayer experience an hour. Let's go to uh, the Dagonoth Kings. Dagonoth Kings. Dagonoth Kings, there we go. It's now we gotta go in HD, which is not the greatest, but eh, I don't really know. I love the fact that nobody. Alright, so I have suspicion that this guy over here is a bot. Where is he? He's over here. He was here at the starting of the video before. This guy right here, I feel like he's a bot. He keeps running over here, like this exact square, somewhere around here. Either there or there, one of those spots my mouse is in. For some random reason, the next time he runs there, I will record. I'll you know resume recording, and you will see like it's just it's completely odd and like it's like he's really slow too. Like he's attacking one every few hours or some shit. So I think this guy's botting Slayer. I don't know you could bot Slayer to be honest. But then again, you know, even if I do catch him on camera botting, um, Jax won't do shit because they don't care. He make he makes them five bucks a month. He. And he's probably bought spins too because he's a faggot, so. This will be really embarrassing if he doesn't come back here, but I mean, I'm not going to wait for him to come back here. I do have only 35 more, so if he doesn't come back within 35 more, which I'm pretty sure he will. I think he came here for like 10 minutes or so. Man, we'll, okay, so I've been here for, I just overloaded recently, so I've been here for, took uh, four overloads, so 40 minutes. I, no, not 40, um, 30 minutes, and I got 30k. No, is that right? I used... No, in order to 40 minutes I've been here and I got 30k Slayer. That sounds right. That's 45k an hour, basically. I'm keeping track of that. Um, maybe like 44.5 right now, basically. I love, I love how Overload just kind of keep track of how long the Slayer task is, but not to mention that um, I got like 55 mil Slayer with with like streams. I don't, like, I don't know how the fuck I did it, but I don't really notice as much. Of, that thing's running way, way too fucking far. Whatever, I'll just take this one. Um, ooh, oh, those were Onyx Pulp. I fucking clicked on that thing. What the hell are you doing? But yeah, I got like uh, 55 mil Slayer with extremes, and then I just started using overloads, and now I'm just really used to using overloads. But um, really, is no difference if you guys do want to ask. If you guys might be doing it with extremes, uh, there's really no difference. I think, uh, what's his name, Jake, rank, rank 2 right now. I think he did almost 200 mil with um, extremes, you know, before he got a lot of donations. Because um, I remember Telmo, when he was slaying, he used to always go, how the fuck is Jake beating me in Slayer? He's using extremes, and I'm using overloads. There's really no difference. It's just a matter of who plays more, I guess. But yeah, I don't find any difference. It's just a little easier to keep track of it. It's like comparing Black Mystic to regular Blue Mystic. Like, there's no difference at all. It just looks different. That's it. Come on, I'm waiting for this guy. Just run over here. Come on, run over here, you stupid little water. Anyways, as for RuneScape Slayer experience, um, okay, there we go. There's 45 minutes I've been here now. Okay. Um, well, no, after this, yeah, I've been here for 40 minutes now. There we go. Now I'm on my 40. Okay, so 40 minutes, 31.5k Slayer. That's above 45k an hour, so that's fucking sexy. But yeah, 373k Slayer experience unlocked so far. It's uh, 1 o'clock p.m. right now, 101. Um, that reminds me of Zoe, Zoe 101. Who remembers that show? Zoe 101. Oh, I remember that show. I loved it. I only watched it because Zoe was fucking sexy as shit. Why does she have to get pregnant? Why does she have to get knocked out by some fucking loser? I want it to be that loser. Oh, look at that. Staff of fucking light. Ah, that's a nice, like, 600k or so. That's my fourth one. I've gotten four staff of... No, I think I've gotten three, because 
I think I bought my first, yeah, I bought my first. So I got three Staff of Light drops within the last, um, five mil Slayer, basically. That's shit. You guys know when these things first came out? They were 25 mil. I remember I traded one for a third age full home, plus cash. Like, I added cash. But anyways, they were 25 mil middle price, basically. Um, I remember getting two of them in one Slayer task, and it was 20 mil each I sold them for. Um, well, I sold... See, instead of selling at max GE, I just sold it for a third age full home, and then I sold a third age full home for max GE. So I made an extra like one mil there because the difference between max GE for the helm and the staff was a little bit different, obviously. But anyways, smart me, huh? Smart me. Okay. So um, yeah, I basically sold one for twenty one mil and sold that one for like nineteen point five, and I got the both at one Slayer task. And oh, just just imagine these things being twenty mil again. Just how fucking awesome would this task be? I kind of wish they did that again, where like just like. Like, Slayer tasks would just be so profitable. Like, you would just... Like, I miss having money from Slayer. Like, I miss making money. Now you just lose money. Making 50 mil from Slayer would take a few days, and it, it was so nice. Like, 50 mil is, like, a nice... It's a nice sum of cash, to be honest. This guy has still not ran back here yet. I know he's, he's done it three times in the past, you know... I like 100 of them. 130. So, the past 110, he's... That means he should come over here soon, I think. According to my calculations... Watch this guy just be like the most innocent person. He, he just runs over here just, just to look at me slaying because he's like a subscriber or like a fan. I am so sorry if you are that. I'm being such an asshole right now. I'm also lagging, but you know, maybe this guy just likes, maybe he's just got something going on with his corner, you know, he just likes it. Are you still fucking like, please don't lag out. Please don't lag out. I want my six hour log. Uh oh. See, good thing I'm not in PvP right now. Oh, you know the time, the one time you run across the ditch to uh, to get to the Slayer Task, like the Water Fiends and shit? The little great, like the wild... Oh, no! Oh, God. Yeah. Can you, can you kind of kneel and unplug this thing? Fuck. Yeah. Fuck, be right back. Well, that's my six hour log. D fucking C. Jack 6 your fucking servers. That's just fucking great, man. I was going for like 500k Slayer experience unlogged. <sighs> Fuck you, Jax. Well, then let's update my Slayer. Okay, now my whole computer's fucking lagging. What the hell? Okay, here we go. Okay. Um, let's update. As RuneScape's loading in the background. Fuck off. Come on, update me. The fuck do you mean no change log time updated? What? I logged. So I'm at 300, I'm at 680k Slayer basically daily, I think. Once this updates, come on, 12 hours. Alright, that's not a thing. Okay, so I'm going to restart my computer now because I want to watch the movie Ted right here. You can see. Okay, so I'll be back soon. I think we're almost, actually not to pick up my cannon, don't I? Okay, let's log in. I love waiting to log into a freaking dicing world. Okay, I'm just going to finish this quick Slayer task, then I'm going to log out. So, is this thing still activated? Oh. Oh yeah, I should always do this when you when you mage. Always do this. It's like a quick 180 magic experience to like fucking one tick. You guys don't know how pissed I am right now. That, that, that this is basically me not. I'm not gonna play the whole day now. I got because I had stuff to do that I was gonna not do. You know what? That's good. That's good. Thank you, Jax, for logging me out. Now I'm not gonna skip what I was gonna do. My RuneScape tracker would have basically said I got like 1.2 mil Slayer daily, even though I don't really have that much, but. Actually, I think I would have said more than that, because I could get 1 mil in a day, plus 6 hours, 1.3, 1.4 mil Slayer, possibly. It's kind of funny, that's like 1 tenth of a skill. That's like 1 tenth of 99 <laughs> That shit used to take months to get that. Oh, right here, right here, right here, look, 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 what is the point of running there? Why would you randomly run in that... He took a shark? Oh. Okay, well maybe his bot is set up to take a... Like, how do you see sharks from way over there to here? How do you see that? You're, you're slaying, how do you see a shark from way in the corner? Like, it must be a bot, because I'm pretty sure a bot can detect, like, a shark on the ground from quite long away, can't it? I don't know. Well, that's kind of fishy. Like, why would you go pick, like, from way over there? I don't know. That, I, I, I think that guy's a bot, man. Because last time he ran there, he didn't pick up anything. Unless, maybe he was picking up, like, a GP or something, I don't know, but... I think he's a bot. What, what do you guys think? You guys think that, guy, that guy's a bot, or he's just an innocent, um person with a life picking up my sharks from way across the map. Alright, yeah, so if you watch this far, which is pretty close to ending of the video, um, tell me, what do you guys think? You guys think he's a botter, or you think he, he's legit, or whatever? Well, if you're a botter, you are legit. You're just, you just have a life, that's all. Alright, there we go. We'll do one more task for this video, and then I think we're done. So, because that stupid thing just pissed me off. I, I don't want to play right now. I, I want to log out and take a break, because I'm almost at 
I'm only supposed to get 500k Slayer in a day. I'm almost there, so I'm just gonna take a little break soon. Maybe I'll come back and get to... Look, he's done his... I don't know. He's been here for a while. That Mithril Dra 20 of them. That's not bad. Let's go. Now, for this task, I'm not sure if I'm going to use Gano or um, Armored... Or, um, but fuck you, random. Okay, well, I'm such a pro. I'm just going to bring both of them just in case. Gandarmeric and this. I want to use this because it's more mage attack, I'm quite sure. But I just compare. I don't even know what the difference actually is. Okay, let's see how much mage attack I have with that and with this. Okay. Hurry up, hurry up. Okay, check. Uh, attack magic 139 with this it's 130 109 mage that looks so cool in HD holy shit that looks really nice what's it look like with Virtus no way I like Ganodarmic more that looks cool the fuck man I might just wear that just because of the looks I might just wear this because of the looks ha <laughs> what a chick move you guys remember this one right below job queen or it's just one click on each, but blow job queen BJQ. That's how you get. Uh, let's see how this works out. What are we gonna hit? Okay, so the first one's a splash. It's very, very nice. Oh, 200 XP hit, not bad. 240 XP hits. Uh, that's not bad. See, I don't. Know, I do like these graphics right here, like HD. Like, it is kind of nice. It's just kind of. It's too different. I don't know. I. I mean, I'm gonna switch it after this task. Hi, my name's number one boss, and I play RuneScape because the graphics are so cool. <laughs> Fucking bitches. I'm sorry, I just hate people that play this game because of the graphics. It just, it makes no sense. It's like a Minecraft game, basically. Ooh. Uh, oh, we have, oh wait, do we have pack axe rules? No. I, I never get the chance to bank these rune battle axes I get because I never have a pack. Well, I could put it in my pack again, just not summon my unicorn. I am such a cheap Jew. Oh, I just said the word Jew. Now I'm going to get hate. Okay, I'm such a cheap Jew, Christian, Arab, everything else. There we go. We're all cheap in this world, for God's sake. Except Catholics. I think I, there's like a few Catholic schools around where I live now. I, unfortunately, you know, obviously there's only a few Catholic schools, so you know. But they are huge schools. These Catholic schools, like, they have uniforms and everything, but they're fucking huge. The one Catholic school beside my house basically has like 3,500 people. My high school got like 1,200 men. And it's like, their high school is like two times bigger. And Anyways, I don't know. Okay, we're all Jews though, right? Yes, thank you. The Jews are the least of the Jews of the Jews. Did that make any sense? Yes, it did. The Jews are the... Okay, that? Fuck Jews. No, fuck talking about Jews. There we go. That's what I meant. This, the ratio of this video just went from 99% likes to 99% dislikes because of what I just said. Great, I should take that part out. Yeah, this is good enough right here. Range, prey, and this. I'm hitting high and I'm not getting touched at all because I have, I have really good mage defense, to be honest. Like, okay, 24. A 2.4. Have the last three Slayer tasks I've done been mage? Steals? And then we went to ice, and then now we're here. It actually might, Bodhi might, Adam might be right. It might be worth to switch your prayers, because these tasks would have all been done a lot quicker, I think, if I obviously had that augur ray. Except for that, I mean, ice, ice strikes, honestly, like, those things die in, like, two mage hits, no matter what. And, like, it really isn't going to make too much of a difference. I mean, maybe it might save you a few minutes on that task, but um, for sure, for sure, steals and miss will be a lot faster with the augur prayer, so... May, I might make a video in the future, maybe testing it out. Maybe I'll do a bunch of hours of Slayer without switching it, and a bunch of hours of Slayer with switching it, but that won't be that accurate, to be honest, because, you know, I could just get all melee tasks when I switch my, you know, that might not make sense, but look at my yak. It's like right, like, it's like sunlight. What's down there? Lights? Oh, these little torch things. Okay. Look at my pack axe. It's, it's like a bonfire right beside it. It's just chilling. Just chilling. I should put, like, a little, little animation right there. Chilling. Chilling, bro. Chillin' Baru. If you guys didn't know, that's what Pakyaks say when they're bored. Baru. Well, on RuneScape they do, so, you know. Baru, bro. Well, here we go. Last one to kill, and that's 3,600 Slayer tasks. Woot. Well, there we go. Task complete. Let me... I got 20 Crimsons. That's pretty good. Holy shit. Oh, yeah, I told you guys I was going to show you guys my charms, which I will... Oh, yeah, I was going to show you my Slayer task. We'll leave that for later on, but I'm going to show you guys my charms after this. All right, our new task is going to be... Neck reels, those are good crimsons, but no thank you. What the fuck, you yak, get out of my way. Here we go. I hate when it calls a familiar to you and then like it fucking takes you out of the window. Grout worms, you can suck my left fucking dick. I don't wanna see a bunch of bodies right now. Bye, okay. We just got 270 points, I don't really give a shit. Um, viral watches, no fucking thank you. Those things are boring as fuck. Um, keep going, keep going, come on, come on, come on. Next, uh, blue. Fuck is this man? This is a fucking horrible ending right here. He's gonna cry. How many tasks? Four tasks in a row have cancelled. There goes fucking how many hundred and twenty points. Hellhounds, there we go. 140, that's it. 
Oh boy. Please, please don't be busy. I got blood belts now. And I can't find a world. Tried world 2, tried world 53, tried world 16. Should tie into world 63. Here we go. It's good. Okay. <laughs> Alright, so we are at 420k Slayer with 2.05 p.m. See, this fucking lagging. I need, yeah, I need to reset my computer still. I can't watch this. I'm resetting it right now, right after this video is just about an hour long. I think it's almost an hour long. I don't know, you guys can probably tell right now, but fuck it. Anyways, who here remembers when they first started Slayer and the first Slayer assignment was like five skeletons or like fucking Banshee? Oh, Banshees were shit. Uh, well, you wouldn't get Banshees first, you did get them like later on, but like, what was it? Skeletons, dog, bears. Bears, I think, are the worst task in the world because there's like four bears and like all of RuneScape and they're spread out and it's fucking annoying. It's right above Fally, I know. It's, there's like three of them there, but like you have to run around. And I remember I, I had my cannon in my inventory because I thought I was going to be cannon task and didn't realize that you, you know. So I kept running around and I, I needed energy. Like I needed to bring energy potions to the Slayer task because there's one bear like way up north and then there's two south. And you just run around, run around, and then your energy runs out, and you just sit there and just wait for energy to come back. That was a shitty task. I fucking hate that task. Anyways, I want to ask you guys, what is your best Slayer experience in a day? Now, and I want to see your answer for this, because, you know, some people get, like, 100k in a day. Some people are like me and just play the whole fucking day and get, like, 1 million. Some people get, like, 200k, 300k, 800k, whatever the fuck the number is. Um, or if you don't really know, then just comment, I don't fucking know you, bitch. If I haven't talked about it yet, um, I do, uh, I think I did the starting, but anyways, let's say it one more time. Um, I do want to uh, have that Slay Day, possibly sometimes next weekend. I'm not really sure about this weekend. This weekend might be the um, the weekend I go to the uh, the beach um, with my friends because um, I'm not sure if it's this week or next week, though, because um, my friend that got his tattoo, he's not really allowed to either go in the water. Or, well, he can shower, obviously. But I hope he can shower, but uh, he has a girlfriend, so that's not going to come out too well. That kind of came out dirty, but it's kind of true. But yeah, I'm not really sure exactly what it is. I think it's, I think he's allowed two weeks. They said after the tattoo, it's a big tattoo on his back. Um, they said two weeks, and coming the Tuesday after that Sunday, we're supposed to go. It'll be two weeks, so it's about a week and like five days. So it's, eh, it's kind of iffy. But yeah, I would not go in the water with a $400 tattoo on my back, risking that it might something might happen to it just because you know I wanted to go into the water at the beach because. Beaches sometimes just for lying down and enjoying the sun. I enjoy that. I enjoy just tanning and then going in the water. But I do enjoy going in the water. I know I'm, I'm like a little kid, man. I go in that water, I just feel so free and so great. And just, I used to, uh, when I was younger, I used to get goggles because I can't see under the water because like my eyes are just a little bit too sensitive and it fucking hurts. Like I get red eyes and I can't see shit. That reminds me. Google Arabian goggles. <laughs> but yeah, I used to um, yeah put goggles on just go underneath. The one time, I don't know if I did not tell you guys this, but the one time when I was on my vacation in Cyprus, there was just two people fucking under the water, man. There was this old fucking bitch and this other fucking old man. They were fucking under the water. I, I had my goggles on, and the first thing I see is just, like, someone's ass. I'm just like, ooh, an ass, right? I'm, I'm just a typical, you know, youngster kid. And then I saw wrinkles on, I'm just like, oh, okay. And then I saw another fucking ass, and it was a guy's ass. I was just like, oh, okay, they're fucking. You know what I should have just done? I should have just swam right beside them, like, underneath the water, and just pop out out of the water right, right beside them, and just look at them, and just be like, hey guys, <laughs> I know what you're doing, you dirty perverts. That would make the guy soft. I'm pretty sure if, if I was doing that in the water, and some guy did that to me, that might make me soft. Actually, it will. You know what I love, though? Nude beaches. Not nude, just, like, topless. I don't really know if there's any nude beaches where I was, but definitely topless. And I remember when I went, because I was grade 7, or something, yeah, I was grade 7 when I went, so I was like, what, 12 years old or some shit, so my mom is just like, now if you see anyone topless, that's a girl, you do not look, that's inappropriate and it's wrong, and she gave me a whole speech on it, and I was just like, yeah, you're fucking funny, I'm looking anytime, I'm looking, I'm gonna look for the nude, for the topless ones, and then if I find one, I'm gonna stare at her the whole fucking day, mom. What kind of 12 year old male would not do that? We obviously look for it, we don't, if we see it, fuck, we're gonna tell everyone and we're gonna look the whole day. Anyways, I'd like to thank you guys for watching. If you watch the whole thing, you guys are just fucking crazy. One fucking hour of somebody talking about dicks, vaginas, hair, subway, um, what else did we say? Slayer? Sure, we talked a little bit about Slayer. But yeah, last time I made a video that was one hour, my first hour Slayer video, well, like my second. Um, it got about, I think it was 20% of the people that started watching it, watched it all the way through. So I want to see if we got more. So if we did get more, do leave a comment like, um, I watched it all. If you've watched the whole end, only comment that if you watched it all. If you fucking skip to the ending, don't do that. Don't comment that. 
But if you did, I want to see how many people, out of how many views we get, um, how many people did see it. So, you know, comment, I watched all thing. If you watched it all, that's great. Um, I'm happy I could give you service for an hour, if you know what I mean. See, in real life, service for an hour from somebody costs a few hundred bucks. For a number one boss, it's free. You just have to watch one single advertisement. And if you have Adlock Pro, you basically don't have to watch any... Shh, don't tell people. No, I'm, I'm not sure if we're allowed to tell people about Adlock or Block site. I mean, the only reason that... Well, see, the truth is that people with partnership would get paid more money if there was no such thing as Adlock. Like, if there was no such thing as blocking an advertisement on YouTube, everybody would be getting paid more money. The only reason that we get paid less is because of the fact that people know there's blockers on, you know, YouTube. So... The people that buy the advertisements, they obviously pay a little bit less because they know that people won't always see the advertisements. But, um, yeah, that counts it there. So, see you guys tomorrow. Um, I'm fucking tired of talking for an hour. I'm going to go sleep for like 20 hours. See ya. Oh, and yeah, 430k Slayer experience gained. And it is... Let me see this. Right there. 2 hours... Or 2.14. Here's a video right here. I have it ready to go. I'm going to render it quickly. And look at that. We're right there. Those are both the clips. 41 minutes long there and I'm gonna add this clip so I will see you guys uh, tomorrow